So, my friend watching this video, I hear that you like electronics. Electronics is something that intrigues you, and you want to learn more about it. You're looking for ways to learn more about electronics. Well, I give you the Snap Circuits Junior by Elenco. With Snap Circuits Junior, you can build over 100 exciting projects. 100! Doesn't that blow your mind? 100! You can create over 30 well, it contains over 30 parts, and you can create your own exciting projects from those 30 parts. This was a Dr. Toy 100 Best Children's Products Award winner. Have fun learning all about electronics. And the coolest thing is, whether you're age 8 or 108, you can play with this product. Now, if you're older than 108, forget it. You are exempt. Sorry about that. If we look on the back of this product, you will see the happiest child on earth. Look at that face. Look at that face. That kid is happy. So if you're sad, this product will make you happy. Because Snap Circuits makes learning electronics easy and fun. All parts are mounted on plastic modules and snap together with ease. Just follow the colorful pictures in the manual and build many exciting projects and enjoy hours of educational fun. There is a dress code for this product as well. You must, must wear some nice brown shoes, khaki pants, and a nice button-down shirt. Oh, and get a haircut too. You're going to need short hair for this project. No long hair is allowed. So you can see there, he's uh, got all the parts there, he's got his little manual out there telling him what to build and how to build it. And this thing has lots of patents associated with it. I will give you a warning, there is a choking hazard. There's small parts, it is not for children under age three years. You can uh, learn more about this product at ellenco.com. And this unit was made in China in 2010. So, we are going to build an electronic project. Aren't you excited? Let's do it together. So the question is, what should we make? Should we make a light police siren or periodic sounds? Hmm. All right, well, let's first start with the light police siren and see if we can get this going. Let's open up the box and here's what's inside. There's a myriad of parts and accessories and things with snaps on them. Don't recommend snapping any of these onto your jeans. You might get electrocuted. So there's all the cool parts we're going to use. Now since I bought this second hand at a thrift store, I'm probably going to need to change out these batteries that came with it. But this is your battery module that's going to supply the magic to make your electronic project work, all right? So, let's see how we can build a siren. Here we go. This is the diagram for project number 22, which is the light police siren. It says, build the circuit shown on the left by placing all the parts with a black one next to them on the base grid first, then assemble parts marked with a two. Finally, insert the parts with a three last on level three. Cover the photoresistor and turn on the slide switch. A police siren with music is heard for a while and then stops. Then you can control it by covering or uncovering the photoresistor. There you go. All right, now we know what to do. Let's see if this thing will work. All right, we have our light police siren fully assembled here on the grid. And we are going to see what happens, see if this actually works. I got my switch on up here already. Well, that was really precious. We heard music and a police siren at the same time. 
I don't know what the photoresistor was supposed to do. Let's do that again. This is exciting. Maybe, maybe not. So I suppose that once light hits the photoresistor, it completes a circuit and tells the machine to start making noise. So this would be perfect for, uh, you know, like scaring the crap out of someone if they came into your room and turned the light on, because then it would do something like. All right, very interesting. Okay, let's make another project. Are you ready? Okay, for our second project, we are gonna do laser gun. Laser gun is project number 18, and the objective is to show how integrated circuits sound can easily be changed to exciting space war sounds. All right, so here we go. Are you ready for some exciting space war sounds? We're using our alarm IC, which is the U2 one. I wonder if that has any, anything to do with the band U2, but uh, here we go. Wow. She isn't very loud, but there she is. Amazing what electronics can do, isn't it? All right. Well, guys, that's all the projects we have time for today. Tune in next time. We will make an air conditioning unit out of this and uh, as well as a, uh, a laser blaster to uh, blast holes in concrete. So until that time, I appreciate you watching this video and uh, please subscribe and leave a comment below this video. And thanks for watching. Oh, and share it with a friend too, that'd be cool.